When a hurricane is eyeing up the Texas Gulf Coast, we all want to know the most up to date information. The problem is more so now than ever before. There's more misinformation being spread around. Social media added fuel to the fire, but advancements in technology like artificial intelligence could lead to life threatening or even deadly consequences. In Fort Bend County, local emergency leaders are sounding the alarm to our Gage Golding in a story you only see tonight on two. In this room, life and death decisions are made. It's the nerve center of emergency communication in Fort Bend County. Everything has to be vetted. Photos, live traffic data and weather, all of it streaming in nonstop. There's so much data that's coming in. The job of Greg Babst in the Emergency Operations Center, use that data and share only the truth with the public. But now with artificial intelligence, that trusted word you hear from behind the podium might be made up. They're called deep fakes. Videos and audio manipulated by technology to look real. You might use the tech in everyday life with apps like FaceSwap. It's that same power of AI that not so nice people can harness to pump out fake videos. Greg seeing it firsthand at a training seminar recently. Using just his name and where he works, a tech guru got to work. Was able to grab my voiceover from press conferences and whatnot that I've done in the past on social media from our sites and then put that capability with AI and putting me in an emergency operations center and telling people to evacuate. All of that in just under an hour. That's the scare of AI and what it can do. Was that experience eye-opening for you? Yes, I, I honestly, like, I, I knew it was out there. I didn't know that it could be that, almost that real. So how hard is it to make a deep fake? Well, we're going to find out. We fed about a minute of Greg Babb's voice to this website we found on the internet, and the goal is to make AI have Greg say that there's a Category 6 hurricane that will make landfall in Sugar Land. It's a completely made-up scenario. So you tell me, does it sound legit? Heads up, uh, Fort Bend County, now is the time to evacuate. A Category 6 hurricane will make landfall in Sugar Land on August 7th. It's not perfect, but it's close enough that you might believe it, especially if it looks real, too. I would say extremely impactful. A, because if we don't know it's out there, how do I stop it? Then once it's out there, how, how, do you, how do people know that that's actually real? It's a problem people already see on social media. I mean, like social media, well, they kind of do it now. It's kind of like a joke. But a deep fake about telling people to evacuate for a hurricane or even worse, not to evacuate is no joke. It could cost you your life. I am actually really, really concerned about that on many levels. You should be. It's not to fear monger or make you not believe what you see, but it should encourage you to check twice on those really important things. Know your sources, uh, vet those sources, and then continue to follow those exact sources. In Richmond, Gage Golding, KPRC2 News.